Evening fellow coin collectors, Coin Snatcher here with another update on the 50p collection. So in front of you tonight we've got one of these lovely boxes that you can only get from the Royal Mint. And that means one thing, new silver coin to add to the collection. So on the back we've got UK21 PSPC. So if you know your codes from the Royal Mint, you'll be able to work out what that is. For those of you who don't know the codes from the Royal Mint, we'll pop it open. And this is one of the Mary Anning series of silver proof dinosaur coins. So these coins uh, originally started off last year with a series of three coins. And then a further three coins were released this year uh, because I've concentrated more on the territories 50 piece and other bits and pieces for the last couple of months that sort of uh not caught up to date with the uk 50 piece so got a few uh more 50 piece to add to the collection and thought i better i better get a couple of uk ones uh, there there's quite a few spaces to fill on the old shelf so uh this little shelf here is where the dinosaur coins need to go there'll be six in total there'll be three bunk ones and or sorry three silver proof color and three silver proof non-color i need to get another decimal day pa4 coin the john logie baird 50 piece going beside that so yeah decimal coin john logie baird dinosaur coins team 2021 gb coins and then the latest science coin which comes out, which I believe is the insulin uh, 50p. And that literally is going to fill that shelf. The proof sets that I have underneath and whatnot, they'll need to get moved on to the next shelf. And then we've got a whole clear shelf to start off uh, with whatever 50p's come out after the, the uh, insulin 50p. So anyway, back to the coin for tonight. And... This coin is a sea dinosaur coin. It's the Mary Anning collection. You can see the little Royal Mint logo on it. And on the back of the little slip, there's a little bit of information there about Mary Anning. You can pause that and read it if you wish. And of course, this dinosaur is called Plesiosaurus. So they come in a really, really nice box if you haven't seen it before. Like a sort of uh, granite type effect box i think like marbly type look really really nice it feels nice as well got a nice quality feel to it and pop that open you have the coa and just before we look at the coa the front and the box flap just comes down so it's easier to get the the acrylic box out so if we have a look at the coa and this is number three four seven eight so if we open it up and inside it will give the mintage figure and the limited edition presentation, the LEP is 7,000 and the maximum coin mintage is 7,410. So certainly interested to know where the other 410 gone. I sometimes think that when you see an extra 10, it's probably for trial of the picks, but uh, that doesn't explain where the other 400 would go to. So their standard specs are 50p, 925 silver, 8 grams, 20.73 mil. Upverse, Jody Clark. Reverse is Robert Nichols and the quality is proof. You have uh, the same little bit of info you get on all the labels there. And on the back, your little hologram. So there we go. That's the COA, 3478. I'll have to see if I have three, four, seven, eight on any of the earlier dinosaur coins. And then you have the little leaflet that comes with it as well. So we'll pop open the little leaflet, have a quick little flick in that. It's quite a quite a nasty looking creature with a great set of teeth on it. And then you have a little bit of info about Mary Anning. So if you wish, you can pause that and have a read of it. I'm not going to dwell on it too long. Astonishing discoveries. An unlikely creature. Dodgers convinced. So yeah, quite a few years ago, 1824 there. 
and then some handwritten notes. It's actually quite a decent little booklet, but normally these only have a few pages in them. This one has quite a few pages, so quite a bit to read. And of course, I'm sure everybody was taught about the dinosaurs at school, so it's a really interesting subject. There we go. And the design and the designer. little bit there by Robert Nichols and that's a little booklet you get with it nice booklet good quality paper nice and glossy got a nice feel to it so if we open this up and let's have a little look so the these coins three of them will come in the perspex box like this with the screen printing on the river on the rear and the other three will come in the standard royal mint black box so i do like the way they have the plesiosaurus uh, it's like a bit of sticky tip that's on it with the name written on it and there you can see the plesiosaurus coin so really nice coin you got the color dinosaur in the middle and then you got some plants on either side and then you have the hand of the fossil in front of it so really nice coin really happy to get that one and to have it join the collection and <laughs> just got just got the other five to go now so we'll see how many 50ps are going to be released i think i'll be concentrating on the uk 50ps for the collection for the next couple of months we may have to put the brakes on the territory's 50 piece uh yeah there you go basically i ended up getting the uh the pop joy tall ship set and the pop joys the fish as well so that sort of made it difficult then to get all the royal mint ones as well so there we go folks we'll get that up in the shelf that's going to look splendid and join me again for another update on the 50p collection that's it for now peace and love coin snatcher out